Hey guys, what's up and welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be me. Girl, I have a platter of heaven. I'm gonna mix together a pump out of each foundation that I have. The only foundations I won't be mixing in is my stick foundations because I would have to like chop off a piece and I literally have almost, I think almost 30 foundations right here. I'm about to try out drugstore and the highest high end. We have Tom Ford down to Elf. We're gonna mix them together, we're gonna trust them out, and then I'll do like a wear test throughout the day. I have my little camera to do that with. I'll probably do one or two check-ins. I have a lot to do today. <laughs> I'm excited for this video. This is like definitely an experiment, definitely a video that's going around. Um, I haven't really watched any of them because I don't wanna know the outcome and like what happens, and I don't really know how they did it, but I'm just gonna do one pump of each into this little bowl, and I'm really excited. I love experiments, especially with makeup. <laughs> We're about to get a little weird today, but I think it'd be cool just to see what happens. I mean, there's so many formulas out there and there's matte and hydrating, long wearing, BB cream. Well, I don't have any BB creams. I have like actual foundations in here, but we'll see what happens. Anyways, I hope you guys are excited for the video. I'm going to sing the subscribe song and then we're going to get to mixing up foundations. <laughs> be sure and subscribe to my channel before you leave. And now, let's go ahead and jump into the video. Okay, so let's begin mixing foundations. I'm gonna switch this over to the vlog camera so you guys can mix with me. We'll do a little fast motion, because <laughs> I got a lot to mix. I'm excited, and I'm gonna have to take off the makeup that I have on, by the way, because, you know. Let's do it, baby. Okay, I have like this makeshift so you guys can like see the bowl. Have it kind of tilted towards you. So shall we begin? We'll start with Elf. All right guys, we have it all mixed together. I'm now gonna take a mixer. All right, so now I'm gonna just mix it all together and then I'm going to go back to the, oh my God, the color looks kinda nice. And then I'm gonna go back to the main camera and we are gonna apply this to our face. I don't know why I thought this was gonna make up so much foundation. It did make enough some foundation for like five people, maybe like three or four actually. But um, yeah, it didn't make up that much. I was scared it was gonna be super wasteful, but it's actually, I mean, not terrible, I guess, cause I put like a dot from each brand. It looks like a um, nice foundation. <laughs> oh my gosh, we had so many different textures and all in here. So there's a close up of what it looks like. So now the exciting part is I'm gonna remove my makeup I have on and we're gonna apply this to the face. Oh my God, what if it's amazing? <laughs> RIT, just removing my makeup. Okie dokie artichokey. I'm just gonna put on a facial primer. So I'm doing this like I would do my makeup any day. I'm just gonna use a little bit of these for Sally drops. Oh, oh, I'm crying unicorn tear. Hard to go around the eyebrows. I normally do uh, my foundation and then put my eyebrows on, but you know, we're gonna work around it today. <laughs> and the lips, I could've just took off, I'm just gonna take off the lips. So I'm going to take my mixing bowl and I'm probably just gonna use the back end. I'm trying to get these chunks, girl. We had a little crusty crust in here, you just gotta chop up the chunks. Is there a hair in there? Oh, there's a hair. Oh, that's nasty. <laughs> How the hell did I get a hair in there? I didn't need to wear a hair net while mixing foundations, apparently. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. 
Oh my gosh, dropped the brush and foundation went everywhere. You guys should see the mess. Great, this is not turning out the way I wanted it to. Mm. So, with all the craziness aside, shall I begin? I mean, the coloring turned out great. I have quite a few different color foundations and that's because I'm a chameleon, I'm just kidding. But um, my skin gets a little lighter in the winter and a little more tan in the summer, so I like to have my options. I'm just gonna dot this on. Can you guys guess what brush I'm gonna use to blend this out? The Lysex from Morphe! <laughs> my favorite. I'm just curious. Okay. It feels very full coverage. Let me just say that, like it feels, can you guys see that? Girl, it feels thick. <laughs> girl oh my god this baby 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 let me just tell you this is covering my dark circles it's so full coverage which means laura has a lot of full coverage foundations on deck the color looks so nice so now i know if i can't find my foundation shade i'll just mix 30 foundations together and we'll get it right oh my gosh i can't believe this is such a cool concept i'm not sure who came out with this video first there's always you know speculation on things like that but if you want who you think came out with first you know put their name down there in that comment section so they can get some love i would love for you guys to do that Ooh. it smells good i swear i think i'm smelling the huda beauty foundation out of all of them but also it blended out so pretty it feels really heavy on my skin and it is so dewy and shiny that I don't even know what's happening. Like the dew just took over. I don't know what foundations are making it this shiny, but holy guacamole. Ooh, I'm gonna put on just a little bit of concealer and a little bit of setting powder because that's how I would normally wear my foundation and we want to give this a fair run, not just plop foundation on and leave. So let me do that really quick and then I'll do check-ins on my camera and we'll finish off the video that way. But this is cool. This is exciting. What else can I mix together? Oh, by the way, if you guys wanted to know what peachy color I had on my lips, it's Brunch by Morphe. That's what I was wearing today. I always get questions on my lip color. Should I mix all my concealers together too? No, that's too much. She needs to calm down. This looks kind of cool. I mean, oh, it's sticky, girl. It's sticky. Okay, just a little bit of concealer. Right there. Who loves Y6? Laura loves Y6. Okay, I'm gonna take the clean one and just softly blend that out. Cause you know, she wants a little highlight. I'm going to take a white lemon brush and a little bit of setting powder and just set. Yes, honey. I'm gonna sprinkle actually a little bit of this all over like I normally would. And it's definitely mattifying. I think I've created the world's best full coverage uh, foundation, just saying. I don't know how it's gonna wear though. Doing just a very light, light layer of powder to help that shine. Okay, it looks really pretty right now. So should I add some bronzer? Let's just keep going. I'm gonna put on some Hoola bronzer with an R14 brush. Now I'm just gonna put on my lippy and I'm out of here and then I'm out of here. I'll see you on the other side. All right, guys, this is check-in number one. I've had on for about three hours. The forehead area is a little bit shiny, but it looks pretty good, which is shocking. And it's super full coverage, so. Also, I'm having deja vu because I wore the exact same lips and eyes and makeup and everything and shirt yesterday as well. I just thought I looked cute yesterday, so I redid it today because I didn't film yesterday. So now I'm having deja vu. Peach. I'm like the same version two days in a row. All right, get Peach. Peach. God dang it. Okay guys, I'm outside so you guys can see in natural lighting. This is gonna be my last check-in. I didn't figure two check-ins would be good. I've been wearing it for about six and a half hours now and this is my final synopsis on it. <laughs> 
<laughs> well, it looks beautiful. Honestly, the foundation looks amazing. It looks slightly cakey. I don't know if you guys can see in there. It looks a little cakey and the forehead is shiny. Shiny, shiny. Can you see that shine? That glow on the forehead? The forehead looks pretty shiny like after an hour wearing it. The rest of my face looks okay. Um, very, very, very full coverage and I think it looks pretty, which I'm so shook about. I'm like, what? It looks good? I mean, overall, I think it looks good. And I didn't set it with a setting spray. Yesterday I did a full Scandinavia setting spray like excursion on my Snapchat and all that. But um, yeah, here I am again updating makeup every day. But overall I think it looks good and I can't believe it and I'm shook and this was really fun to do. So thank you guys for watching. Be sure and subscribe to my channel. Bye bye. Yeah, like, subscribe. And I think that's it for today's video. Thank you again for watching. I love you guys so much. And if you have any other fun challenge videos for me to do, comment down below. I might do the kids makeup challenge. I wrote in the community section about that and you guys were saying you wanted to see that or the wet makeup brush challenge or the blindfolded picking out your makeup. There's so many challenges, but just tell me what you wanna see. Cause I wanna do some fun challenges. Love you guys, bye.